a Dear Media original podcast. Today's episode is brought to you by ZocDoc.com. ZocDoc is the only free app that lets you find and book doctors who are patient-reviewed and take your insurance and are available when you need them to treat almost any condition under the sun. I just downloaded the app myself. I was so impressed by how many doctors, all different kinds, and dentists there were that were not only close to me, but took my insurance. And the thing is, is I think there are so many of us who, when we have a health problem, we go straight to our friends in the group chat. And our friends are amazing and reliable, but we are unlikely to find quality information in the group chat when it comes to health. So with ZocDoc.com, there are thousands of medical professionals that are there to help you and they will listen to you like a friend and give you the expert care that you need and deserve. With ZocDoc, there's no more doctor roulette. So we're not scouring the internet for our questions. With ZocDoc, we have a trusted guide to connect us to our favorite doctors that we just haven't met yet. There are millions of people who use ZocDoc's free app to find and book a doctor in their neighborhood who is patient-reviewed and fits their needs and schedules just right. Go to ZocDoc.com slash instincts and download the ZocDoc app for free and then find and book a top-rated doctor today. Many are available within 24 hours. That's Z-O-C-D-O-C dot com slash instincts, ZocDoc.com slash instincts. Hi, welcome to Good Instincts. I'm Shira Barlow, but you may know me as the food therapist. Join me every Monday through Friday for bite-sized episodes designed to help you close the gap between where you are right now and where you want to go. This should feel good, like really good. And it will, I promise. I think a bagged work lunch can have a bad rap as being kind of sad, but I think that is incredibly misguided. And I actually think bringing your lunch to work is such a flex, especially if it's something that you actually want to eat. There is nothing worse than not having a great lunch option at work and being forced to like leave your desk and acquire something that you don't really want or worse, forage in the office building pantry. And for many of us, leaving midday to grab something isn't always in the cards and it's just not that feasible. So I wanted to get into rebranding the work lunch because I feel really strongly about it. I've always been really inspired by the jar salads, but I felt kind of intimidated by them. But Alyssa Goodman, who was a guest on our show a couple weeks ago, she sent me this three-day reset and there was a jar salad in there every day and I absolutely loved it. Here's what I learned. So the trick is really to put the wet or the moist, sorry guys, who's triggered by that word, but those ingredients at the bottom of the jar, like chicken or cucumbers or tomatoes, those go at the bottom. And then the more crisp stuff like lettuce is at the top so it doesn't get all soggy. And for some people, they put the dressing right in the jar first thing. And then you let the chickeny, tomatoey, cucumbery things marinate in the dressing, but you don't have to, and that can be on the side. So I thought of these three variations that could be really amazing and involve the same amount of prep, but they're different enough that you could do them again and again if you liked them. So here's how I was thinking, and it's kind of like a formula. So I think for the protein, the best thing to do would be to have If you're a meat eater, do something like poached chicken or store-bought rotisserie chicken that was shredded up. For someone that was plant-based, I do think air fried pumfu is a really great option. I tried that recently and I am such a meat eater that I am so unbiased and I thought it was really nice and it's something that I would totally eat. So here's how you do it. You throw in the protein at the bottom, whether that is the chicken or the pumfu. Then I would add some cucumbers and tomatoes. Then, and here's where I feel strongly about it, I would roast something. Like for me, I would roast portobello mushrooms in olive oil and salt. And I would do that at 400 for 20 minutes. You would put those next in all the jars. And then I think you could add something, a heartier vegetable, like a purple cabbage or just cabbage in general. And then on top of that, you could add a softer lettuce like romaine or butter lettuce is what I would use. Then this is where it gets interesting. I think that then you could mix it up three different ways. So you could go one direction with dressing where you could go, I love the 
Primal Kitchen Sesame Ginger Dressing. It is extremely low in sugar and it's really special tasting. You could throw some furikake on the top of that. That could be one type of salad. So it's the chicken or the pumfu. It's the cucumber tomatoes. It's the roasted portobellos. And then it's the cabbage and the lettuce. And then the add-on is the furikake and the sesame ginger dressing. And then for the other one, it could be the same exact jar, but you go more with a simple Dijon vinaigrette and you could add like toasted pine nuts to that. You could add sun-dried tomatoes to that if you wanted to. And then a third, you could go kind of more Middle Eastern and you could maybe add some smoked paprika to that and like a tahini dressing with cumin. And so basically, this is kind of like a uniform for the week. So it's basically three of the same salads, but you could mix it up with different dressings and really basic different add-ons. I think that that is really exciting. And you could also add in something like a cup of beans. You could add garbanzo beans or black beans or a grain like quinoa or rice if that's something that you wanted. And it ends up being really filling and nice and feeling really special. And I feel like if you brought that to your office, people would go nuts. It would be the opposite of a sad desk lunch. If you wanted to get fancy with it, you could throw herbs on there and you could even play with like a bibimbap salad with mint and cilantro and toasted peanuts. I think that this is truly a great option and it is something that I have been playing around with a lot and I'm going to continue to on Instagram. I would love to know if you do any of these. I'm really excited by this because I love when there's a small lift and you cook once and eat three times or more and you can be roasting a big tray of those mushrooms and do a batch of poached chicken and air fry up that pumfu. And it's kind of a really easy lift for something that you're going to be able to eat again and again. The other thing about it is I totally don't knock cutting any corners where you want to and getting a store-bought rotisserie chicken is totally fine too. But I love the idea of not recreating the wheel to make things feel really fresh and really special because the better it feels, the more likely you are to keep going with it. I've been playing around a lot with these. I'm going to play around with them more on Instagram. Come find me. I would love to know if you make any of these. Let me know how they turn out. I love hearing from you. Tomorrow, we're going to get a bit personal and vulnerable, and I'm looking forward to it. I'll see you there. Thank you so much for listening to Good Instincts, hosted and written by me, Shira Barlow. You can find me on Instagram at Shira underscore RD. Good Instincts is a Dear Media Daily Today's episode is brought to you by ZocDoc.com. ZocDoc is the only free app that lets you find and book doctors who are patient-reviewed and take your insurance and are available when you need them to treat almost any condition under the sun. I just downloaded the app myself. I was so impressed by how many doctors, all different kinds, and dentists there were that were not only close to me but took my insurance. And the thing is, is I think there are so many of us who when we have a health problem, we go straight to our friends in the group chat and our friends are amazing and reliable, but we are unlikely to find quality information in the group chat when it comes to health. So with ZocDoc.com, there are thousands of medical professionals that are there to help you and they will listen to you like a friend and give you the expert care that you need and deserve. With ZocDoc, there's no more doctor roulette. So we're not scouring the internet for our questions. With ZocDoc, we have a trusted guide to connect us to our favorite doctors that we just haven't met yet. There are millions of people who use ZocDoc's free app to find and book a doctor in their neighborhood who is patient-reviewed and fits their needs and schedules just right. Go to ZocDoc.com slash instincts and download the ZocDoc app for free and then find and book a top-rated doctor today. Many are available within 24 hours. That's Z-O-C-D-O-C.com slash instincts, ZocDoc.com slash instincts.